Hey there, George from Wow Factor Photography located in beautiful Santa Clarita, California. Here with a tip that I could not find anywhere on the internet. I am now using Pinnacle Studio Ultimate 21 and what they did was change how you can reverse a clip in case you want something to go backwards instead of forward. Like this one that I shot here at the end, that one's already reversed. That was uh, my, this was a drone uh, video that I was doing in aerial footage. And yes, I am a certified in part 107 with the FAA to be able to uh, fly drones commercially and talk about them on the internet. But uh, uh, I was flying up and then I flew down. I liked the flying up part better, but I wanted to make it look like it was landing. So I wanted to reverse the clip. And everything else is going fine, but in Pinnacle Studio fashion, they tend to move things around and make things less intuitive. You used to be able to just right click on the clip, well, select the clip that you wanted to reverse, right click, and then you would find your, uh, uh, it would usually under like speed or something, and then you could just, uh, it would open up a second window and you click like reverse or something and I couldn't find it I spent a half hour I went online to see if maybe there was another tutorial on it and couldn't find one so I thought I would build one myself so here's what you do if you want to reverse a clip I'm going to use this little one here uh, I'm not going to officially reverse it because this video is actually already produced but I will show you a couple things you can do you can either click on editor up at the upper left there next to library or just double click the clip that you want to edit which is what I did and give me a second and even though this is a, a very uh, high-speed computer we have this use so you've got all these things here that open up now but where is the reverse you go all the way to time remapping and it's coming in and then you would find reverse here click reverse and of course it's going to take some time for the the clip to process because uh, it's all in HD and especially this camera is pretty uh, pretty high definition and uh, it has some large file sizes so just give yourself a little time uh, you will continue to work on the rest of your video if you like there it is thank you very much feel free to subscribe to this channel because I will be providing more uh, educational informational uh, videos not only on editing but also on photography and I appreciate you being here thank you